Hi guys, my name is Quincy Gardner and today I want to talk about film editing. Film editing is essentially when you're taking a bunch of your footage that you went out and shot, you're putting them together in a sequence to form your final film. And so it's one of the most fun parts of post-production, in my opinion. Uh, every time I'm writing, every time I'm shooting, I'm always thinking about uh, the edit. And so uh, software that I use, I use Final Cut Pro X, Premiere Pro, and uh, but there's there's also a lot of other software out there that you guys can use. Uh, there's Final Cut Pro X, Premiere Pro, Final Cut 7, Avid. There's also Autodesk Smoke, I believe, and Sony Vegas. Uh, so uh, there's there's a lot of different options. I'd say pretty much whatever fits your preference would be your best bet. Because uh, a lot of people ask which editing software should I use, but you know, of course there's so many variables. What kind of operating system do you have? Uh, your specs and things like that. Though, but um, I'd say another quick tip as far as people who are getting stuck if you edit your own films. Please edit, throw out your whole film on the timeline, even if you think you're missing shots, then go back. Uh, it's never, never great to be stuck in the middle of an edit because you're missing a shot and you're just sitting there for a couple days trying to figure out the next shot. Trust me, I have been there. Another thing that I did, I, I do with my editing is do sound effects and music. And so um, for the latest film, I actually worked in uh, Logic Pro X and GarageBand. So I'd say for any of you guys out there looking to score for your own films or do sound effects, definitely check out a GarageBand or Logic Pro X. GarageBand is is fit more for beginners. Uh, some of the features are you know kind of gutted by Apple. Uh, the newer version of GarageBand has been gutted, but uh, nonetheless, it's still a good starter software. Uh, if you're not looking to make your own software, though, there's a great website called The Music Bed, and they're more geared towards independent filmmakers. Uh, it's, it's a lot easier to obtain a license, you know, with uh, not that much money. And uh, also for any event videographers, it's great for wedding music. Uh, they have some of the most beautiful music on there. Some great uh, independent artists is up there. So I definitely, definitely suggest checking it out. But as far as when I'm done with my edit, what you're gonna see right here is uh, with Premiere Pro and After Effects. So my Premiere Pro, it's simply I, I can I can copy my Premiere Pro timeline. I can open up After Effects and I can paste it. Uh, so that's usually what I do. I bring my timeline over to After Effects, and with After Effects, I do my color grading, my compositing, uh, any removing or VFX things like that. Also with uh, Final Cut 7, for any users out there, you can simply export your timeline as an XML and import it into After Effects. And other software, they also have their ways. Uh, you probably have to look that up. But uh, in After Effects, essentially, uh, these shots right here are actually some shots that I got at the weekend of going to hang a rock with my son. And so um, at the end of this video, you're actually going to see the result of this real-time edit right here. Actually, it, it's kind of sped up. But um, trust me, it really didn't take me that long. It probably took me like 35, you know, 35 minutes to like 35, 40 minutes to pretty much edit and, and, and color grade the shots, though. Uh, so pretty much this, this is the most fun part. Uh, you know, post-production is just, you know, the editing, uh, the sound, and also just getting in there and color grading, getting the looks that I want, uh, taking all my taking all my clips, you know, doing a technical grade first, making sure they all match up, and then uh, applying my look to the footage. But uh, anyways, I hope you guys found this video somewhat uh, informative and uh, until next time I'll talk to you guys later he said come wonder with me love come wonder with me away from this sad world come He came from the sunset, he came from the sea, he came